Cyberbullying. Does it exist? In a certain amount, yes. In another amount, no. I've lost problems with somebody on my small channel. And because I have not so much subscribers, one single one can be a very annoying. This person harassed me on the internet. He's a kind of a stalker. He insulted me. He said that I have to kill myself. He claims that I've been a psychopath, that I've been insane. I call, he called me transgender. I've not been a problem with transgender in the part that are being not totally man or woman or something like that. That's not my problem. My problem is with transgenders that they're praise for peace and not being even willing to extend rights to the most innocent and the most abused victims of all the animals. Same thing is uh, with uh, uh, any group of humans, black life matters, gay life matters, and all the, uh, all the uh, schisms of human choices. As long as it don't harm other living beings, do what you want. This person also claimed that I have a um, on the internet say that I want to kill him. That's one gross, hypocritical lie and slander. What I actually have to say is that I wish that I have the right word and I reply wish I have the right to kill him because he is in totally waste of the problems. Because he's not capable of understanding jokes. He is not capable of understanding logic and he is not capable of uh, understanding morals and watching things from another perception. It's a waste of the planet. I truly believe that the whole world is better now. I don't have to say that I want to murder them or something like that, so he's totally insane in that. And that's the problem also with that. That's the reason that I've blocked him and that I've deleted a lot of his comments because they're being salty as hell and extremely insulting. And I don't tolerate on my channel insulting. In particular, of the most and uh, oppressing of most innocent of all victims, the animals. You can make a joke about humans suffering, but you cannot make a joke about animal suffering because they're being the most oppressed, the most disempowered beings of hell. It is not funny to make fun of. Make fun of victims. And he is not a victim. He's a gross slaughterhouse worker. So if he has say in his videos. The person if we come with another channel on my channel now and harass me, he know what he how I talk. Or he is even more insane than I ever can imagine. I myself 
Yes, I don't like humans at all. Also, it don't mean that I be a violator of humans. I think that humans be not more superior than other animals. And maybe call me crazy, but I stand for what I stand for. And I say a lot of things that most people don't maybe be afraid to say. But please be not so irrational that you think that I also do all that things that I say. <laughs> I see myself as one um, philosopher, cabaretre, um, Psychological experts and all rights activists, musician. So take not always what I say to let to literally. Sometimes it is a joke. No, I feel to ask it. Even being a joke, if you don't understand it. I've been most likely one of the most honest persons on YouTube. I don't lie. I don't manipulate. What I say, that's truly what I think. I'm mean, not a politician. And nothing will be. I think politicians be the most biggest problem on this planet. Just like that uh, political correctness social justice movement. There be no problem makers. Just don't make the uh, problem disappear by uh, by saying that you don't can do something. You want to let I explain it in uh, more detail? Watch the video there in the description below. I've been bullied for a long time in my whole life. I can handle a lot. If it come to me, if you har har if you harm other animals, I found me that more offensive and more and break my heart more than harming other humans, because humans take and take activity without regard other from other animal species to take. Let me not forget any second of any day humans in the western country let children starve from starvation in Africa. Reason they want to eat meat, dairy and eggs. So don't ask me to respect or love people in the first countries or people in the first countries that choose to eat meat, dairy and eggs. Also, don't ask me to respect humans on the fact that there be humans. Respect you all humans, Trolley. Respect you also KKK members. Respect you also Nazis. Respect you also Gaddafi, Joseph Stalin, King Kion. Are you serious? I think not so. So don't blame me. Blame yourself. Blame yourself for not caring about the most innocent and most vulnerable beings on the whole planet. What think you that you give the right 
to decide what your dollar are. And the life of another living being is an old fast system. Power of the most strongers might make right. Compassion of always to conquer. Industrial, industrial, indoctrination, and evil traditions. They've been based on cruelty. Animals being not on this planet for human consumption, just like women be not there for the man and only for the needs of the man. Just like gay people be not on this planet to uh, give their to put aggression from. Um, heterosex men on in so that they can kick them or something like that just like black people be not on this planet as slaves and only for the service of the white man just like the slave masters that I think in the time of the slavery all living beings being there for their own reason And it don't matter what other species do, because if you use them the compare to nation fallacy and say that lions eat uh, other animals. If this been a justification, lions eat also sometimes their old children. Is there been an op overpopulation of lions? Or if they don't want the lion? Can you go to a judge and say, Judge, lions e eat their children, so why I cannot? Or lions uh, have a man, have many different relationships with many different other lions. So why I cannot to have 20 wives or 20 men? Or lions uh, walk naked or on streets. So why humans cannot walk naked? So lions sometimes sniff. Uh, lions greet each other actually um, by smelling each other's ass. If you did it by humans, that's not acceptable. So by using always carnivore ways to bathe. Hmm? To justify your evil behavior, and if it don't suit your needs, then not do that. That's irrational. One kind of inequality creates always another kind of inequality. Countless compassion. To any living being is the only guarantee of great moral contempt. As long as um, Pythagoras once of said, as long as humans will be the ruthless destroyer of other living beings, they will not hell find health or peace. Indeed, who said see the sates of hate and murder will not find love or peace. Two hundred and fourteen thousand Acres of rainforest being cut any day. Imagine one place with a size of New York City, bigger than the size of New York City, that be cut for animal feed. Around something like 51%, uh, uh, around something like 
70% of all the greens, all the lentils, all the soy on the planet they feed to livestock for animal feed. Animal agriculture is the biggest cost of animal and human abuse. That's the reason that I don't like humans. Spectacular humans in the first world. And also people in the other parts of the world that think that they're superior than other animal species. And that they have the right to take and take and take a little bit more. We polluting the oceans, killing a lot of marine species. Have you once think about all the things that go on it, on the part of all this notions? Awaken humans. What's the problem with it? What's the problem with not casting huge amount of destruction on the planet? Because animal agriculture is also the leading cost of global warming. Around something like, at least, numbers from 2009. Responsible for... percent of the greenhouse gas emissions. And that's not only the, um, uh, not only uh, the greenhouse gas and the cows make themselves, but it's also been the trans uh, the stuff that we transport to the animal industry sector. The um, greenhouse gas is what is produced to grow the crops. All the greenhouse gas that being cost to drive the cars and think you not that the meat industry also lie a little bit to let it look like I will also just say if they're being less destructive than they're in action maybe think you that they regulate this perfectly I think not. Also, you take the, uh, the habitats of orangutans away so that they can grow more food for animals that you that they want to abuse in the meat therapy neck industries. Why? So why ask me to respect humans for that? I be not so blind, so myopic, so delusional that I over anything praise my species or my race or my sex or my land or my country or something like that. I speak for the victims. No matter for which kind of season you belong, I be for justice. No matter how it be, for how it been or to who against. And the law is not justice. One times the law also protect white slave owner um, from uh, perfect protection and from execution for harming black people. Of raping black people. So the same is now with other animals. Still happening. So don't tell me that the law is justice. The law is just the status quo. Screw you. 
You have no rights. You have temporary privileges. All is all what yeah, what you have is a bill with temporary privileges that your government can take away from you when they want. So. So ask me not to have respect for people because they're being humans. And don't feel insulted when I say something that you don't like. Or somebody else say something that you don't like. Maybe it's been true, maybe not. And sometimes it don't matter if it don't harm somebody, some other living being. The humans being not the only beings that I want to live. Only beings that can feel, can suffer. And if it come to moral consideration, there's only what can, not only uh, can make an action moral. It is mo not moral to hang animals upside down on the slaughterhouse floor and, and cut their throat. It is not moral to eat animal products. It is not moral to artificial inseminate what a uh, euphemism is for rape other animals for the profit of the human. Just like not moral from the slave masters to do this with blacks. Just like it was no more was no moral was not moral that their white Christian slave owners they have done this with women. Morality can only come from compassion and malice. And yes, malice is only justifiable when it's being to protect the victims. Malice is not justifiable when it is for your own self. So, what, uh, what is the problem for not karma feeding? You think not that the whole planet worships uh, humans? Or, being, or you think that? Think you that the whole world think humans being the most important thing on this planet? And that anything have to pass for humans? No. When darkness and light become one, the reality spins in a way and the truth becomes visible. I choose rather to be true to myself and encourage the ridicules of others than encourage my own neck horns and be false. I know what I stand for. Do you know what I stand for? <laughs>